Hello, hello, and welcome to another amazing Rich Alvarez live stream. I'm Rich Alvarez. Now, I've already taken the liberty of going to the secret level and getting a ton of lives before I started streaming, so that way I don't have to bore everybody with that process. We got some people in the chat already. I see Nacho Taco. I see uh, Daniel. Um, I see Dante Peebles. Welcome. Welcome to the stream. Uh, Blaze is here. Uh, so we're gonna get started. We're gonna try to beat this castle. I did a late night stream last night So in case you missed that I got all the way to castle six and uh, we are here to um, To try and beat it <laughs> Anyways, uh, yeah, AK is here. Son Goku's here. Frigga Tony is here. Yeah, we're gonna we're gonna uh, in in infin, infinitum gaming is here uh, and uh, PRS 722 is here and I'm sure more people will come as we go but for right now we are going to play some Super Mario World there we go don't forget to give this video a big fat like uh, that is what uh, YouTube likes to see <laughs> so I see there are 11 people right now and only seven likes let's get that number up shall we I don't need to get that power up because it's just going to give me a mushroom and mess up my, uh, my feather. Oh, Matt Provinzo is here! Oh, whoops. <laughs> That's what happens when I look at the chat. <laughs> he says, hey, it's Mario! We're going to beat this today, guys. Feel it like it's right in my neck. <laughs> oh, whoops. Oh, well, here we go. <laughs> uh, let's see if I am refreshed and uh, there's one. And that was two and I died. Oh, it's gonna be one of those days again, everybody. <laughs> uh, Infinitum says, it's fun to watch Red Luigi play games. <laughs> oh, boy. I never, I never get to keep the feather, never. <laughs> okay, I gotta be extra careful with big sun dude there. Here we go, here we go, this is the one, this is the one. If Killjoy was here, she'd say, this is the one. And he just fell off, didn't he? <laughs> okay, okay, here we go, here we go. Oh! That's two, that's one, that's one. Okay, there's no way I'm gonna get to her on that side right now. That's two? Okay, I can't, I can't kill her when she does the upside down thing, I think. And that's three! We did it! We did it! Finally! Second attempt today. It's like my hundredth attempt overall. Oh, yes. Uh. <laughs> well, uh, Animating Gamer, we haven't heard Chris Pratt's Mario voice yet, so we can't exactly... <laughs> he's just gonna... He's just gonna wipe the paint away. It's Mario Sunshine! <laughs> Wendy O. Koopa in Castle 6 has sung her last song. Mario must meet the challenge that is now before him. There is a sunken ship that appears to be a gateway to the Valley of Bowser. Ooh. <laughs> yes, uh, exclamation mark hearts will give me red hearts. Exclamation mark uh, dead will give the black hearts, of course. Continue and save! I see, so they, they let they let Yoshi come in the underwater ghost. How does Mario breathe underwater? That's what I've always wanted to know. 
He's just a man, after all. Yoshi cannot eat the ghost as much as I wish he could. Oh, what? That's highly... Oh! This is incredibly irregular. <laughs> ah. Oh, boy. <laughs> yeah, maybe the water is just breath breath breathable in the Mushroom Kingdom. You never know. Oh! I would really like that mushroom, please. <sighs> Mario, Mario, Mario. Uh, how do I get through that mess? I have no idea. for them to go so I can make a little bit of progress. Oh man, they have this extra long, don't they? Oh cool, then they got the ones that just fly around at ya. You gotta stare at them. You gotta stare at them so that they don't... Face the other way, stupid! <laughs> okay. Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. <laughs> oh man. Ooh, fun! This is supposed to represent like Mario falling all the way down into Bowser's like secret area. as possible right here to get those lives up. Oh, and just like that, we're dead. Wow. Incredible. I now must start all over again. <laughs> Can you believe it? This game is so unforgiving. Well, at least we got several lives out of it. And we'll get several more lives again. Yes, yes, I know. Alright, there are 13 of you now and only 11 likes, so let's get those likes back up. Oh my goodness. Why must I fail at every turn? God, it's gonna take forever probably to do this again. This is horrible. <laughs> Face to face with a boo. Ah, boy. <laughs> Come on, Mario. Let's try to keep this as long as we can. Ghosts are terrible because, like, you can't kill them. It's not like in Mario 64 where you could just, like, run around them or whatever and confuse them. They're already dead. Hence ghost. Ah, it's so hard to stay afloat. Especially when you're big stupid Mario. Oh, 
Oh, that was close. Damn it, same place! Same place! Oh. Yeah, it would be better if we got that mushroom after the, the room, wouldn't it? Because, uh... <sighs> yeah, and yeah, it's underwater too, so, you know, they try to... Really unforgiving here. I get for trying to read comments at the same time. Don't worry, I've got excuses for everything. <laughs> okay, let's try to stay relatively low. Nope. keep dying at that same spot. I wish that the, uh, the star power had lasted longer because, uh, during that one point, because I definitely would have, I was really close to finishing the level until I got hit by a spike. We have our first super chat of the day. Uh, MG26 says, have you heard about that Luigi's Mansion beta, like, pre-Luigi's Mansion? Oh, you mean like the early, the early... Uh, version of the game that they showed off in Space World or whatever. I mean, I've heard of that. I don't know if that's what you're talking about, but I have heard of that. Beta, the, the YouTuber Beta64 did a video on it like forever ago. Incredible. Okay, so we got through what I consider to be the hardest part. Oh well, that's okay. <laughs> Anything to get through that faster, I guess. Stare at the ghosts so they can't move towards you. And then we'll go down here. Okay. Okay, we're just gonna try to get straight down as fast as possible. Oh, I do want that mushroom though, and I feel like there's like no way to really get it. <laughs> Locking in a couple lives first. I guess there's no way to make that last longer than that. Okay, here we go. I just have to live. Oh. Oh! Uh, MG26 says, yeah, that. <laughs> I just, just hit the, uh, the question mark. <laughs> AK says, so they made the boo part slightly easier in the Game Boy Advance version. Yeah, uh, I believe it. Every Whenever they port or remake, they always make it easier. All right, here we go, everybody. We're in Valley of Bowser. We're at the last part of this game. Let's see if we can beat it today. Hello, Smitty. Hello, the Owl Star. Um, welcome to the to the to the to the stream. Oh. Oh dear. Haha, <laughs> you're stuck. Ooh. I don't care for these giant mole people. Oh, it was all for a coin. Oh dear, oh dear. Ooh, I guess that's what this is for. <laughs> Oh, look at what I found. Oh, 
Oh, there's like... Oh, I, I see what I'm supposed to do here. Hilarious. Oh! Oh. Oh, I see. Yeah, just follow me this way, dude. Haha! -ha. Oh, pfft. Just for more coins. Maybe I should have had him go that way, I don't know. Oh! Actually, I think that I'm supposed to, like, use them to climb. I don't think I was supposed to do it that way. <laughs> Oh yeah, come this way, dude. Oh, I guess he can't break those. Okay, cool. Ah! Oh, I have a feeling I'm supposed to get up there. Oops. <laughs> uh, animating games to spoiler, I never finished Super Mario Brothers slash World. Oh, wow. Why not? <laughs> Why would you do such a thing? <laughs> what? I totally jumped over here. Also, this is not where the half point was a minute ago, so what happened? I guess I can't go down that one. That's rude on two accounts. <laughs> Uh, are there any RMA productions coming up? Just me playing Super Mario World right now, and then, well, I am as I, as some of you know, I am writing a movie script that hopefully I will have finished soon. In fact, I should be writing that and not playing this. <laughs> but I've decided to play this instead today. Uh, right now the movie doesn't really have a title. I've been calling it How to Party at 35. <laughs> but I'm hoping to come up with a better title. But it is in the works, don't worry. There we go. It is a comedy about old friends coming together to... Put on a party they are clearly too old to throw. Um, in the style of early 2000s comedies such as that one Will Ferrell movie that I can never remember the name of. <laughs> uh, yeah, so anyways, yeah, I am writing the script for that. I've been writing it for like six months. Uh, it's taking a while for me to like figure out exactly the tone I want and everything. But I would say that right now uh, it's looking pretty good. But you guys will be the first to know when it's finished because... Yeah, old school, thank you. The movie I'm thinking of is old school. It's kind of like old school, but with a little bit more heart to it, I think. That's what I'm going for. So, um, yeah, just think old school, but like smarter with more heart. <laughs> Oh dear, that accomplished absolutely nothing. Oh dear, I don't know how I'm supposed to get over this one. Oh, there's they just keep coming! Oh, that's one way to do it. Anyways, yeah, so I'm working on a, I'm working on a movie script. When the script is done, I will let you know. I was hoping to have it done by the end of March, this month. Uh, so we'll see. And when the movie is finally, when the movie is finally written, then we will start talking about 
production and moving forward with it and everything. I just didn't want to get your guys' hopes up before the script was actually written. But I, but you know, I've talked about it before. I am writing the, the movie. MG26 has super chatted again and says, "Do you wish we can still use music from licensed songs on YouTube like we used to back then?" Uh, of course I do. Um, there's, you know, there's, you know, royalty laws and all that stuff. You know, I, IP. You know, it's crazy. Um, technically, I guess we never really were supposed to, but, you know, they allowed it in the early days because they didn't really have a way of tra keeping track of everything. But yeah, it would be nice to use licensed music, or at least, you know, it would, there, it would be nice if there was, like, an actual, like, reasonable way to contact the musicians to get their permission, but there's really not. Uh, anyways, uh, thank you, MG26. Thank you very much for your super chat. You are most, uh, most, 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 most welcome here. <laughs> Extra most. And once again, we are on the last legs of these of, of this game. We are in Bowser's territory, ready to rock and roll here. Everything's pretty much an underground level now because we are underground. Oh, he's just gonna jump off to his death. Oh, I didn't know there was a bird up there. halfway point so that's good Arr, wait, I wanted those wings that means there's something above up here cool well whoops uh, Ryman 6000 has super chat and says are you excited for Obi-Wan oh oops I am. That trailer looked really cool. I like, uh, oh, wings only work as Yoshi. Thank you. Um, yeah, I, I was, that trailer, you know, had all the right things in it. Had Duel of the Fates, Battle of the Heroes, Ewan McGregor, you know. Um, we had the, the breathing of Darth Vader at the end there. It was amazing. I think it's going to be pretty good. I really hope I don't get crushed. Okay, I guess I, what I gotta do is like run up as fast as I can. This is probably a, a big risk. All right, risking it for two coins. <laughs> the cookies ask, "What is this being played on?" This is on uh, S uh, SNES emulator. Um, Hey, Killjoy's here. I'm at work, so just popping in to say hi, chat, and good luck with the game. Thank you, Killjoy. We finally beat that castle. Ooh, this is... I don't know about this, guys. Oh, that's a trap. <laughs> All right, so got to get over here. And I guess I'm going to have to just run as fast as I can this way. Yup. <laughs> Uh, who's building who built this elaborate trap in this cave that's what i want to know <laughs> it's all bowser you know if bowser used his his intelligence for good um he would be like the greatest like contraption maker of like literally all time okay i i, I gotta figure out exactly how i'm gonna get over there fast enough That's probably the hardest part so far. All right, cool. Killjoy's gonna watch the replay later. Okay, just wanted to see what I'm dealing with over there. So I think what I gotta do is go like this to give myself a head start and then go all the way over here. Okay, all right. Wow, they sure know how to make these stressful, don't they? So you can't build levels like this in Mario Maker. That, you know, that obviously the published games will always reign supreme. Wow. Okay, and it's a race against the thing that's gonna kill me this way now. I, I thought that maybe it would come up this way. Here we go. 
Oh, yep, this one's still coming. Oh, oh, oh no! I thought I was safe there for some reason! What? <laughs> what was that? Oh man, I gotta start all the way back from here. This should not be the halfway point. That's not halfway at all. Oh my goodness. EDMG7 is here. What a bunch of crap. I'm just gonna speed run this because I'm not spending another 10 minutes down here, that's for sure. <laughs> oh, that was probably unwise. <laughs> you gotta get that on the down, the down, the down one. Oh boy. Oh, a lot of bunch of crap. <laughs> The AK says, talk about a crushing defeat. Ha ha ha, you're hilarious. <laughs> EDMG says, yeah, you ain't speed running this. <laughs> Thanks, man. You're the best. <laughs> oh dear, oh dear. Okay, so this, I gotta wait for the down, because there's not enough room to get up enough. Okay, here we go. Running. <laughs> no problem, he says. I think the whole idea is you gotta wait an extra step for this one. Yeah, because there's like, there would be no way to make it all the way across that in one go. I think. so close. Timing is everything. Okay, here's where we died. Oh, I see. Well, that's a bunch of crap. Did it! That's how close we were to beating it last time. <laughs> Another ghost house! with the star. Amazing. Okay, that was just coins. Maybe I'm supposed to go this way now? Maybe I was supposed to go through that first door. Whoops. Oh, 
door number one. Takes you all the way back to the beginning. Well, well at least I get a mushroom. Alright, let's let's go this way as fast as we can. Just kidding. Okay, I really need the star to like come at me from the opposite angle. So that way I have enough time to like do this proper. Okay, one, two, three. We had enough time to get to door number three, which is the exit! Hooray! <laughs> Woo! There we go! Hooray. One step closer to Bowser. And we gotta beat, as you notice, castle number seven is right before Bowser, so we have to beat a boss before the final boss. Matt is here and says, I win for some reason? I just, just ran right into my death. <laughs> ah. There we go. I was trying to jump onto that four. That's what I was trying to do. <laughs> we got a super chat from MG26 says, have you tried the Pikmin games? Oh dear. <laughs> I have tried the Pip the Pip Pip Pip. I've 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 played Pikmin one. I enjoyed it. level. Okay, we can go down. I'm never gonna get the secrets, never! Here we go. Hooray! I got three one-ups out of that. <laughs> He's died, says Matt. Thanks, pal. Do us a favor. Let's <laughs> quote Monty Python there. Let's get it over here. Cool, we got some firepower now. Alright, that's one way to do it. Oh, we got this terribly dangerous looking uh, slanted one here. Oh dear. No! What was that? Ah, oh, I should not have held the run button. Oh my goodness. Oh dear. <laughs> and now we must start all over again. Annoying. If you just tell yourself you're going to lose, then you'll never be disappointed. <laughs> okay, 
here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go this time. Here we go this time, here we go this time. Oh, why? Oh, crap. <laughs> ah. Cool. Exclamation mark dead. Oh, oh, party foul. <laughs> Why do I have to make this so hard? <laughs> uh, <laughs> Infinitum Gaming says a comedy of errors. Especially with this, like, goofy-ass, uh, Three Stooges music they got for this level. <laughs> it's like, I'm overcompensating and I'm, like, running and I run off the platform. Thanks, Blaze. Uh, Blaze says this game isn't hard, you just suck at the moment. Thanks. <laughs> Always a friend. Uh, we got a super chat from MG26, who says you probably should have considered... Hold on, I, I can't read it at the moment. I'll read it in a sec. What? Where? Interesting. There was nowhere to go. Uh, MG26 says, You probably should have considered making Olimar into a character for Stupid Mario Brothers back then. I think we did consider Olimar a character, but he would have had to have been like microscopic or whatever, so it would have been weird. I don't know. I don't remember. There was a lot of conversations about putting a lot of characters into the show back then, and then we ended up, we ended up putting a lot of characters in, but not everyone. Oh, there were, I missed a four block somewhere, apparently, says uh, Infinitum. Oh, this one. I think I'm supposed to take this one. That's the trick. Okay, this is the four... That was the farthest I'd ever made it, and I'm pretty sure that's the end of the level. Why did I... Why did I run off? <laughs> why am I so stupid? <laughs> Case in point, right there. <laughs> oh, dear. I gotta remember to let go of the run button. Let go of the run button when I don't need to run. It's just so easy to be panicky and hit the run button for forever. Believe me, I know. <laughs> what is the tech behind those blocks? I don't know. Apparently, well, I mean, Bowser does have magic cubes working for him, so you know, he's got he's got a mixture of magic and science. Okay, here we go. Don't press the run button. It was right there. I was so close to it like three times. Uh. Oh, sorry, All Star. I, I I don't know what I did to um, to do that, but I'm sorry. Ah! He's throwing like dung at me. <laughs> AK says, don't press the run button. I always hold it the entire time. Well, that can be dangerous, as you saw. Oh! 
What? <laughs> I guess somehow I'm sp I'm supposed to run there. Hizzy says, oh, his oh, it's Hizzle. Hizzle. Oh, I know. <laughs> Hello, Hizzle. <laughs> you you changed your username. Uh, Hizzle says you can do it, and I don't know if you're if you're mimicking the uh, Sierra College commercials where they say that you can do it. Uh, Western Sierra College or whatever those commercials were back then, but uh, but thank you. I I think I can. It just takes a lot of a lot of one ups. A one a lot of one ups to get through this. <laughs> Uh, am I going to see the Mario movie, says the animating gamer. Well, of, well, of course I am, after I die from this dung ball. <laughs> oh, Matt Provencal says it was Western Career College. Yeah, Western Career, Career College. You can do it. You know, all of that plus... Uh, <laughs> Hizzle says, why, yes, yes, I was. <laughs> all of that plus the Shane Company. Hi, I'm Mark Shane with the Shane Company. Now you have a friend in the diamond business, blah, 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 blah. You know, I always thought that the Shane Company was exclusive to the Sacramento area, but apparently the Shane Company is all over the country. So let me know if you heard those commercials on the radio. They still play them on the radio. It's like, but it's, that used to be now you have a friend in the diamond business, but they changed that because, you know, blood diamonds. So now it's you have a friend in the jewelry business. Now you have a friend in the jewelry business. I'm Todd Shane or whatever, you know. Oh no, EDMG7 says, what's a radio? <laughs> Please don't kill me with dung balls, Mr. Football Player, who now is a, a dung. Maybe this is, oh, I guess you can't, you can't butt stomp them. They just, they just kill you anyway. <laughs> Trying to jump over the dung ball? <laughs> Hayaki says, Rich, get good, please. Hey, I'm almost at the end of this game, okay? It's taken me seven Let's Plays to get to the end of this game. I'm almost there, right? I am doing my best. My best isn't good enough, Brad. All right, we only have one life to live, and I'm not going to die here and lose all my progress. So we got to do the old classic of going all the way back to the secret level and getting more one-ups. Oh, it's going to take a hot minute, I know. <laughs> That's hilarious. Oh. <laughs> yep. I'm seeing a lot of a lot of interesting comments in the comment section. <laughs> Here we go again. Again. We are so close. We are so close to beating this game. to enter on the ghost house. That would have been interesting, wouldn't it? Alright, let's get our Yoshi, first of all. Okay, now I've got my feathers. Now we just keep repeating this till, I don't know, I'll, I'll get 15 lives. That sounds good. He says, we do it because we love you very much. Well, thank you. <laughs> uh, I see 20 viewers and only 18 likes. If you haven't liked this video, give it a big fat thumbs up. As Chris would say if he was here. <laughs> I gotta fix this chair so it stops leaning back so much. <laughs> Alright, alright, just gonna mil milk these lives, milk these lives. Yeah, 
in Fanatum Gaming says, honestly, the fire, fire flower is much better than feather unless the level specifically needs it. The slow fall can cause many deaths. Um, well, yeah, that's true. It can mess up the timing of jumps, but I feel like it's, I feel like it's more useful, especially if you're on Yoshi, because you can't use fireballs as Yoshi, when you're on Yoshi. Uh, so the cape is more helpful there. And, I don't know, you just you just have to get used to the timing of the jumps when you have the, the cape, I think. I don't know. Could be wrong. I often am. <laughs> one more life to live, or, uh, you know, one more life to get. <laughs> And then we are we are on our way to freedom here. Okay, let's go back and try again. <laughs> okay, well, I better stop yawning. <laughs> I gotta keep the energy up on this video, otherwise it'll be a sleepy time. All, the all-star says, inserts, please subscribe. Please subscribe! I don't say that till the end of the video. Infinitum Gaming says, we yawned at the same time. Well, yawning is, like, contagious, I swear. One person yawns, and then everybody yawns. I gotta go through here to get to there, you know what I mean? Heavily confusing, I know. Alright, look how close we are. We just gotta beat three levels to beat this game. Okay, now can Yoshi eat the poop? He can't- Yoshi ate poop! <laughs> oh no! No, come back! No! <laughs> Oh my goodness, that's hilarious. See, look how much the cape helped there, because I was able to hover and get to the other side. Okay. Ooh, I don't want that mushroom, it'll mess up my feathers. <sighs> That's okay. Yoshi was dying of dysentery anyway since he ate that poop, so he was... Oh, cool! I lost everything, except for my lives. <laughs> oh, boy. Alright, let's just, let's just try to get through this as ci civilly as possible here. Just kidding! Ice is slippery! Ice is slippery! Watch out! <laughs> Speed run time. Let's go this way instead. Oops. Pfft. Let's fall off three times. Okay, let me get all the way over here first. Oh, Yoshi's back! I made that joke in one of my Mario videos where I'm like, he's just gonna die, and then uh, I'm gonna find an egg, and I'm gonna call that one Yoshi as well. Forever Yoshi. I'm gonna get off Yoshi for a second. So, yeah, then we can do that. Whoa! See, 
See, that would have been a perfect time to jump off of Yoshi. <laughs> I'm really, I'm really upset by that one. <laughs> uh. Oh, I was, I was looking at chat. All Star says, Richie, long jumps, please. You play so delicately. It's adorable and frustrating at the same time. But that sounds dangerous. Those are some long jumps. Or I think the long jumps. I think he means like when you run and get a big boosted long jump. Long jumps are for, for winners and I'm not a winner. <laughs> I was gonna say are for suckers, but then I died and I had to say for, for you know. Anyways. Back to this. Oh. <laughs> Hilarious. Okay, so I think the proper way to do this is this way, so that way we can get to this like extra area here. There we go. Yeah. Oh dear. Sorry, I had to sacrifice Yoshi there. You saw it. You all saw it. I finally did the Yoshi sacrifice properly. I did it all to win, Yoshi. I'm sorry. Oh, I was so close. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, did I hit? Oh, I did. I hit that halfway point. Well, that's cool. <sighs> well, how am I supposed to get over that? I guess I gotta wait like a second before I jump on that one. Oh well, lesson learned. Oh! <laughs> Whoops. <laughs> Everybody's saying I deserve to die because I sacrificed the Yoshi. You touch poop, you die. <laughs> Okay, let's go, let's go, let's go. Waiting. I could do that. Oh well, beat the level. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> Not hitting these. <laughs> Cool, I got a one-up. Well, I'm probably gonna have to go back and get more lives in a second because I'm only at six, and now we have to beat castle number Shevin. And then as soon as we're done with this, we have to go and do Bowser. Only two more levels to complete. Ah. Oops. 
Z's. <laughs> Gotta do this all again. They had to make it extra hard by having the floor move, of course, you know, because they figured why not. There we go. This is the only proper way to do this. And by proper, I mean not proper at all, because I died. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Thanks, Daniel. I gotta, I gotta watch it. I'm almost out of lives. You like Let's Plays where uh, it takes me uh, 20 attempts to get through every single level? Well, you'll love Rich Alvarez. <laughs> He's the best at exactly that. Oh, I screwed up again. What do you know? What a surprise. <laughs> ah. <laughs> They could at least have, like, a couple rotating castle songs. Especially since the next level is going to have the exact same song. Film Plumber Night all over the place. <laughs> Anyways, <laughs> oh, wait, I'm on my last life. Oops. Um, well, <laughs> I really screwed it up here, didn't I? <laughs> so, AK says, just win, easy. <laughs> I'm trying to remember how how far back would I have to go if I I'd have to go back to the ghost house like two levels ago. Oh man. Shoot. Hmm. How to do? How to do indeed? <laughs> Nocto talks says longer stream. Hooray! Sorry, I didn't say anything to you guys there because I was trying to do... I was giving it all my might and all my concentration. <laughs> and I will have to do the same thing for this second half of the level so I don't die. Boy. I'm running out of time on the level as well, so that's always fun. 
Okay, so I think what I have to do is have him... Yep, I gotta do exactly that. Balls. I think I have to... Oh, wait! Mario could probably fit through here now. <laughs> I gotta get the Magic Koopa to, to come up here. And that's the end. I was so close. I was so close. You have no idea. If only I didn't have to rely on an enemy to do something, I could have done it. So now I have to beat these two levels again. <laughs> oh boy. Well, I don't know. Should we keep going? Should I should I do them again or should uh, I'm going to go back and get lives either way, but should uh, should the stream keep going or are you guys done with the stream? Let me know. Damn, I was close. Uh, that's a shame. Super close to that. Oh no, Elster, there's crouch, but you can't crouch in the air. You can only crouch on the ground, so I couldn't, like, crouch and get into a weird space. Alright, Elite Gear is telling me to keep going. Whoops. Uh, Daniel is telling me to get 40 lives this time. It's probably wise. I just hate to bore you guys with getting continuous lives and such, but... I don't know, if you want me to beat this game, I'm, it's gonna have to happen. <laughs> Cool. <laughs> Alright, we're gonna just enjoy each other's company while I get these lives. And yeah, we're gonna get at least 40 lives this time. Uh, DT is saying you have to do a minimum jump to get in those spaces. I guess I could try that. It's just a little hard to concentrate when magic koopas and dry bones are throwing stuff at you and you... Ah, man, I was so close. I, I gave it my all. I was, I was getting there. And I'm being told to get some feathers and flowers instead of the capes. Or feather slash wings. Now nah, we'll get we'll get flowers this time. See see if that helps. <sighs> Forty lives. Here we go, everybody. Forty lives. Don't forget to give this video a like while I'm getting lives. <laughs> I noticed that like I went from thirty four viewers to twenty two viewers as soon as I got a game over screen. I lost all those people that were probably just here to watch me succeed. Little did they know that half the fun of Rich Alvarez is watching him fail at life. And I'm not just talking about Mario World. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> that was horribly negative. I apologize. <laughs> I'm just being silly. <laughs> oh! Got it. <laughs> What shall we talk about, ladies and gentlemen? I've got, uh, let's see, I've got 21 more lives to get. I was paying attention to my lives until I wasn't, you know. But having one life left really made me determined. It's a shame that I, I still died. I was, I was getting there, though. I was, like, so focused. <laughs> 
28. Uh, certain plays asking if I'm gonna do any other classic Mario gameplays. I had asked everybody on last night's stream what I should play next. Your options were Final Fantasy VIII, Chrono Trigger, Diddy Kong Racing, Mario 64, or Metal Gear Solid. You must pick from one of those. But it's gonna happen, you know, and whatever, you know, like, I'm gonna play one of those when I'm done with this game. I'm not really sure how to determine who wins that. I had a lot of people on the Discord say they wanted Diddy Kong. I do love me some Diddy Kong Racing. <laughs> uh, uh, Sterlita is here and says, Hey Rich, sorry I'm right f late. Final Fantasy VIII uh, is, is the choice they're picking and says there are cheats for that. I don't need cheats for Final Fantasy VIII. I'm actually pretty good, great at that game. I understand the complications of the junction system and the draw system and like people hated that game at the time because they're like, what? You gotta draw magic from enemies and then use it to like do this complicated junction system to attach a uh, hundred Firigas to your elemental defense if you want to beat a what you know any, anyways I love that stuff though I love that micromanagey crap you know what let's go for 50 lives we might as well couldn't hurt am I right <laughs> <laughs> uh, the animating game says during the fights like Blue Hood, Blue Hood and Plumber Knight, uh, was Chris the one doing the stunts like flips and such? Nope, that was all Garrett Allen. That was one Garrett Allen, our karate expert, uh, Garrett Allen, who is amazing at doing all that. <laughs> AK says, do I hear 60? <laughs> Yeah, I'm, I really want to play Final Fantasy VIII. I think I've done Let's Plays of Final Fantasy VIII, but like most games uh, I Let's Play on this channel, I never finished it. That's why I'm so determined to finish this game, so that I can actually say that I completed a game on this channel. I've never completed a Let's Play ever on this channel. This will be the first one. That's why I've been going so ham on it. All right, we're at 50. I'm going to call that good. Yeah, AK says I did Final Fantasy VIII back on Twitch in like 2017. But I definitely only did like one or two Let's Plays of it and didn't finish. We have a new member, Fire... Fiery Paper Mario is a new member. Congratulations, you are now a member of the channel. Hooray. Hearts. I will finish it. Whatever, I'm, I'm determined now. The, when I let's play a game these days, it's to win it. <laughs> To complete it. Okay, here we go. That would have been a really great time for a Yoshi suicide, wouldn't it? <laughs> and now I have nothing. Got to use my extra fire flower here. Mm -hmm. 
You know, I do think that the cape is probably best for this level. But the fire flower is good for castles and such. Oh, or I could lose everything right there. That's always a good option. He said with great disdain. You saw it, you saw it. <laughs> Oops, at least I got the halfway point. Ripperoni, says the all-star. play that dangerously. <sighs> you get to watch me fail at all the same levels all over again. <laughs> but you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna do this smartly. I'm gonna get the extra mushroom first. So that way this will be a fire flame. I don't like that. <laughs> oh wait, hold on. Let's not do that mistake again. Timing was perfect! How did that happen? <laughs> I don't understand this game sometimes. It's like, sometimes it, it's like you're a pixel off or something. Oh, hold on. Oh, boy. Incinerate those turtles. <laughs> Turn them into money. This <laughs> sucks. Ha. Wow, that was lucky. Wow. <laughs> Amazing. All right, now we have to beat this terrible level again. Y'all remember this terrible level? Oh, we're gonna die from poop again. It's gonna happen. 
It's just, you know, it takes a long time to die from dysentery, but the, the game is just helping you out by giving you a fast and speedy way to, to just deal with it immediately. I was actually trying to jump off of Yoshi and it didn't work. <laughs> oh my goodness. I kind of know what I'm doing this time. <laughs> oh, look, I didn't have to sacrifice my Yoshi that time. Halfway point? Oh, what am I thinking? Yoshi could just... Yoshi just straight up eats shit. <laughs> I'm being told uh, that that's right. There is, if I get that key at the end, I can bypass Castle 7 and go straight to Bowser, I think. That is what I'm being told from Fiery Paper Mario. Let's see if we can achieve that. except I had to sacrifice my Yoshi to get to the other side, so unfortunately, no bueno there. Oh, because I could have used his tongue to get... Yeah, whoops, I biffed that, didn't I? Oh well, we're just gonna play this like the only way we know how. <laughs> if I can do this with the same precision and determination I had when I thought I was going to get a game over. <laughs> the dude says, are you rich? My name is Rich. I am Rich Alvarez. Am I rich? No, I would say that I do not have an incredible excess of money. I, uh, in fact, live very much paycheck to paycheck. <laughs> Oh, look at that. I might as well just throw myself in lava because there's no way of getting back on top of that. <laughs> Amazing. This, my friends, is why we went and got 50 lives. <laughs> Still, though, I was able to get through those other two levels a lot faster than I did the first time around. That's, that's what happens with familiarity plus skill. Plus time. I don't know, plus other equations, I'm sure. Do I prefer Rich or Richie? I really prefer Rich. Although my old friends consistently call me uh, Richie just because that's what they're used to. I'll, uh, I'll allow it, but <laughs> I really do introduce myself to everyone as Rich, and then everybody ends up calling me Richie for some reason. <laughs> Whoa, that was weird. Yeesh. <laughs> Thank you. 
Over jumped. Over jumped. <sighs> Oops. Why? <laughs> I'm not sure if Matt is still here. He probably got tired of watching me suck ass at this game, you know? <laughs> okay, okay, here we go. This one's for real. I'm gonna stop making dumb mistakes, I hope. close to beating this game all right we finally made it successfully onto that platform I don't know, people are giving me advice in the uh, in the chat but like I can't look at the chat long enough to, to read exactly what it says. If only Chris was here to read the chat for me. <laughs> Hello, uh... Somebody new just entered the chat. I can't really look at the chat long enough to read who it is because I'm gonna die. But congratulations, or... <laughs> congratulations. Somebody said something about the path down here having a checkpoint. Aha! Sweet. Thank you. I did see that. It is uh, Tornap Terra says, Ain't that my childhood hero going live? Oh, thank you and bless you. <laughs> um, thank you, whoever gave me the advice on that checkpoint. Thank you, because I do not want to do that beginning part ever again in my whole life. Oh dear, oh dear. Alright, here is exactly where I died last time. Oh, cool. Oh, I thought I was being so clever there. I am running out of time. Oh. I made it through in haste and then died in lava. Good thing we got that halfway point of a ride. <laughs> cool. Comes with a mushroom. Uh, Akamari is here, says, hey Rich, hey, how's it going?
Aha. Good thing I've got a spare. Oh, same thing again. made this dangerous, didn't they? Okay, oh, now I gotta beat a boss, too. <laughs> I didn't know they were gonna also have flames come out. Oh, Hayaki says this is a nightmare's nightmare. <laughs> uh, could you imagine if I didn't get this halfway point? I'd be starting from that beginning area every time, and it just—it would be stupid. Well, nobody can say I didn't make it to the boss. saw nothing. Just, just waiting for Magic Koopa. I feel like I can work with that. thought I had jumped over him. Hmm. Alright, here we go again, again. Good thing we have 35 lives. Oh, I thought I was just gonna land right on top of him. Little did I know this game hates me for some reason. I'm doomed to fail. <laughs> okay, here we go, here we go, here we go. I feel like I'm not getting any better at this. See that. <sighs> Can never get the mushroom, never. Come on, come on, where are you? it right there. <laughs> oh my goodness. I wonder, can magic cookies be killed with fire flowers? I think they can. I want to just go back and get some fire flower. Just to, just to get this done. Come on, Wario, there you are. Oh, fun. Let's 
so close to beating this game. I just want to beat it. Oh, what's up? Wow. One of the things I was trying to do worked that time, and the other thing did not. Come on, where are you, Magic Koopa? No, sir, you are wrong, AK. I can go back, get more lives, get the fire flowers, and I would still have this halfway point. We've done that on many levels before. I come back and the halfway point is still there. I have no idea why that's not working like it should. sees me. Not that high, though. That was a really bad idea. <laughs> oh, boy. Yeah, because I think in the Game Boy Advance version, they counted the secret area as a level, and it shouldn't be counted as a level. So, like, you're not completing a level when you do that, and therefore you can come back and still have your halfway point. Oh, I was stupid! Oh well, at least I can get through it easier. Will I ever get th that mushroom? I feel like the only way to get it is... is th what the... what the... what? What's the difference between Magic Koopas and the other guy? Is this a joke? Is this like a setup? What's the difference between Magic Koopas and the other guy? Or like, do you mean the, I mean like, Magic Koopas have magic and other Koopas don't. <laughs> like, I don't know. So stupid. Ha! Huh. Got it that time. I just can't be scared to jump across the way. Ha ha! Oh, at the last second. It's like everything in the world can kill me at this stage. I don't, yeah, this is an Archmage, uh, Koopa. I don't think it's supposed to be Kamek here, though. I, in fact, I'm pretty sure Kamek was not a character yet. He was not, he was, I'm pretty sure Kamek was created for Yoshi's Island. That was the first appearance of Kamek, if I'm not horribly mistaken. Uh, okay, uh, Killjoy says, Ayo, we still, uh, alive? Yes, yes, I can watch on my lunch, my lunch break. <laughs> It's 
It's like, I can't jump on the stairs when I'm going down. Come on, where are you? Amazing. <laughs> ah. I don't need to go get more lives yet. I still have 25 lives. Small victories. gonna happen. Damn it! There's always so there's too much there's just too much going on in this level. Excuse me for being alive. <sighs> AK says, just tried this level, took me three tries. Come on, Rich. <laughs> jump high enough. Ah. <laughs> Let's just all admit that I'm terrible at this level. And I'm not great at this game overall. As much as I love Mario, I'm not the best. Oh boy. I never claimed to be the best at this game. <laughs> that would be a lie. <laughs> Thank you. 
Close enough. <laughs> I will never get through this level. Hilarious. Welcome back to Mario Teaches Time. <laughs> Thanks, AK. Into. Hilarious. Just screwing up Royal all over the place. much better at this as a kid, but it's because I, like, had more time to practice, I guess. I don't know. Excuses. <laughs> Magic Cooper never shows up when I want him to. Yeah. <laughs> Someday I will be disagree. I think that this level has nothing to do with finger finesse or or, or or timing because you don't know when these magic Koopas are going to show up. They're kind of random. So like you have to rely on the enemies to show up and you have to rely on the enemies to, to you know hit the blocks at the right time. So you, this, this, this level requires the enemies to do a lot of the work for you and therefore it's out of my hands for a lot of it. made it to the boss with a power-up. What do you know? Die! No, I was so close! <laughs> oh, that was, I was so close. I just had him one more time. This is in a this is a crap situation, isn't it? There was there was no, that one got ugly. That one got ugly. <laughs> yeah, I need to figure out where the green switch is because the green switch gives me that like one up at the end or whatever and that would be super helpful i don't remember where the green switch is though oh dear oh fun
Oh, love that. Sometimes I hate this game. <laughs> uh, green switch is westernmost level in Donut Plains. All right, well, I'll, maybe I'll go check that out. All so I can do better at this level. <laughs> do a different level. jump because the skeleton was coming back up. I'm gonna go do that right now, so at least we'll have a change of scenery. <laughs> change of scenery. Oh boy, I'm gonna... Probably lost many subscribers today. <laughs> I, I don't know. People are disappointed at my lack of Super Mario World skill. I was really hoping we could beat this game today, but it looks like we might not. But let's see. Somebody's saying if I get a feather, yeah, if I get the cape, I can spin kill the dry bones. That's true. That would help a little bit. Oh, come on. But I also want to get uh, the green switch so that way it'll allow me to... Ah, you see, I never even got Donut Plains number two because I did the secret to get up to here. So I have to beat Donut Plains number one the secret way. Or the normal way. I don't know if I did it the secret way in the first place, and that's what got me the thing. Oh, whoops. <laughs> Oh, I knew that was going to happen. Hey, come on. Get, get, let me get on your back. Oh, why? Why in the world would they do that to me? Oh, cool. Okay, so I think that's the normal way, and that's what I didn't do last time. So, let's find out. Hey, look, we beat a level. <laughs> That's refreshing. Okay, so Donut Plains 2. So there's a secret exit here, allegedly, that will get me to the green switch. That's what you're all saying? Or maybe I was supposed to beat the secret here to get to the ghost house? I don't know. 
Oh, I love the Batman, by the way. Yeah, thanks some Norwegian guys asking if I saw the Batman and liked it. I really did enjoy it. I think it's probably the best Batman to Batman. It was the first Batman movie that felt like I was actually watching like the comic book on screen because he was actually doing like detective work and so on and so forth like he just felt like actual Batman and not just a guy doing cool stuff in a bat suit like you know Christopher Nolan's movies were good but they feel like and I've said this to all my friends Christopher Nolan's movies were good but they kind of feel like Goodfellas featuring Batman and not really a Batman movie um, they were just cr good crime movies um, whoops Cool. But I feel like this movie is like actually like a Batman movie. Cool. Super cool. Uh, if Minim says you, so you're supposed to do normal to get green switch to access the secret. I don't quite understand, but I will figure it out. Was I supposed to go through this fast? Whoops. Okay, I've had just about enough of this weird scrolly cave. I hope this doesn't go all the way to the ceiling. We have a super chat from MG26 says, What do you think of King Kong 2005? Like, so Peter Jackson's King Kong. Um, I enjoy it. Um... I don't like it as much as the original film, of course, uh, but I think Peter Jackson did a pretty good job on it. Um, I will... I, I admit that I think I prefer Kong Skull Island, though, because I feel like that's, like, a cooler movie that isn't just a remake of a better movie. <laughs> And it also leads into King Kong vs. Godzilla, or Kong, Godzilla vs. Kong, whatever you want to call it, and I really enjoy that. Oh, that should have killed that thing. Come on. Come on. Okay, hold on a second. Let me, let me. Okay, yes, yeah, Stone Plains 2. There will be a pipe in that level. There will be a vine block to give you a key. It was one of the pipes you missed. It's been 10 years since I played this game myself. It was one of the pipes you missed, so I've already missed it? Like, so do I have to go back? Was it one of the pipes up here? Oh, maybe it's this pipe. It was this pipe, maybe. Why did Mario headbutt in all his fights? I'm assuming you're talking about in Stupid Mario Brothers? I don't know, I like to headbutt. Okay, well let's just beat this level the normal way, I guess, and then we'll figure out uh, what we're supposed to do for the secret. All right. All right, let's go back. Well, since we're here, might as well get some power-ups. Like Yoshi, a mushroom, and then we'll go back and we'll get some fire flowers. I don't think that was the right pipe because it did not take me to the secret. You need to get to be big to get the shell and get it upwards. All right, well, let's see if I can understand this better this time. Oh. I'm gonna pause so I can read the super chat. Super chat from MG26 says, then you should try play the game King Kong. It's Xbox, Xbox 360, GameCube, PS2. 
I don't think I, yeah, I don't think I ever played the tie-in game. I will see if I can get my hands on it, though. I don't think it was this one. I think it was this one. Oh, I got crushed to death. I don't think it was that one. Have no effect on the shelled ones. shit right there. <laughs> yeah, let's just get all these birds out of the way. Okay, so it's not... Oh, it is that one. Okay. <laughs> Let me see if I understand this correctly. Okay. Um, Mario not having the item for Boomer was next. I'm sure to they have no big Mario to get. Have to be big Mario to get the purple shell in that level to hit that top yellow block or jump off Yoshi to hit the top block. Okay, I understand, I think. But I probably shouldn't have been a fire flower Mario to do it. Well, let's find out if I can do it some other way. <laughs> cool. <laughs> yeah, there's like no way. I definitely need like a Yoshi at this point. I'll just do this to leave the level. And then I'll come back, um, and actually no, I'll do this again. I'm gonna go and grab a Yoshi real quick. So let's see if I can actually do this. Everything, Yoshi. I did not finish the game, All Star. I'm I'm uh, attempting something else right now. Nope. Oh. Just my luck. Oh. <laughs> oh wow, that was incredible. But I'm gonna die anyway. <laughs> I'm attempting to get the green switch. Uh... So what I actually want is feathers. So I need to get feathers. Okay. And the, 
the whole point, the whole reason of me getting the green is because uh, there's a green block at the end of that castle that uh, will give me a power up so that I don't die. <laughs> Uh, but I have to have a green block to get. So this is all just to help me beat the last castle there. I'm not going to be getting any of the power-ups here because I already have all the power-ups I need. And I don't want anything to screw up my whole plan here. Uh, yes, I did get to the boss room. I just couldn't beat it. <laughs> oh, okay. We almost got across to me. Jesus. Okay, here we go. So there's how we do that. I do unfortunately have to lose Yoshi here. So I can do this. Whoops. Cool. I gotta wait for that to stop spinning. Use a feather or try to keep Yoshi and eat the purple shot to fly out. Oh. Oh, wait a minute. I understand now, I think. Yup. Like that. <laughs> cool! And that's the green switch level. That was gonna be like. That was weird. Well, let's go get another Yoshi just, just in case. Uh, I do not really speak any Spanish. Sorry. That was a question from Super Mario himself. To use the you were supposed to use the fire for lives I don't understand oh wait I get it so I can go like this but it, but the other way the actual way I'm supposed to do it and not like an idiot like I did just now that kind of except work whammo okay cool we did it Now this will make that last boss marginally easier by just giving me a power up right before I go in. Continue and save. Hey, we get to continue right there. So that's nice. But I'm going to get about, I'm going to get up to 25 before I go back over to the castle. And I believe now that I've already completed some levels over here, I will have to start from the beginning of that castle. So we'll see. I got the blue and red switches, so I have the green and yellow switches tapped, but not the other ones. <laughs> Let's go! Hooray! <laughs> One more. 
That's correct, Infantino. So even if I screw up and completely die, I will be able to go from this point here and I'll basically lose no progress now. Which is cool, but I still want live so I don't have to go through the whole game over process or whatever. Is there any Mario games I've never played before, says Carrie Marshall? I don't think so. I feel like I've really spent a minute on every single one of them. At least. I've at least attempted every Mario game. I've, I've of course, completed all the major ones. Believe it or not, there was a time in my life when I was actually good at this game. I'm not the spry young man I once was, I guess. I don't really need the red switch, I think, for this, though. I, you know, I might want to look into getting the blue and red switches before I attempt Bowser, because I know there's a lot of areas where it's like, it'll those will fill in gaps at the very least. There. Wow! Amazing! Now I don't even have my cape. It's such a fleeting thing to have a power up. Cool. Well, cool. I wish that secret area was a lot closer. <laughs> oh, the checkpoint is saved. Cool. Yeah, somebody pointed that out. I guess your checkpoints are always saved as long as you don't get a game over. So that's cool. This is why, after I beat this game, I really want my next game to... I'm just going to play Final Fantasy VIII. I, I really want my the next game I play to be Final Fantasy VIII, because that's a game I'm really, really good at, and it'll be much less embarrassing for me than this. Nice. Oh, I thought I jumped a lot sooner. Well, that leaves a nice little... Oh, I thought I jumped enough. I don't know. Crap. That was such bull crap right there. I'm getting worse. Oh great, Carrie Marshall says I could never get by this level. That's, uh, that's not very hopeful for me. <laughs> cool! record myself playing this game and then only like edit out the clip where I beat the level so you guys don't have to constantly watch me just fail again and again. I wonder what this will be. Oh, it's still a mushroom? Oh well, good to have an extra mushroom, I guess. Like for moments like this.
here we go. All oh, right. <laughs> There's too much going on in that boss room. I think I would have preferred a fire flower. So it's too bad that that's not a fire flower. I attack too much, but you gotta you gotta like keep hitting him so he falls in the lava, so it's like it's hard not to keep attacking him. It's kind of what you gotta do. Oh, missed that opportunity. We'll pause for a second. We have a super chat. From MG26, MG26 says, Did you know Vin Diesel's Triple X movies tie in the Fast and Furious movies? I actually don't think that they do. There might be an Easter egg or two, but they're not actually supposed to tie in. And thank you for your super chat. Maybe they do, maybe, I don't know. Okay, here we go. Cool, <laughs> losing it immediately. I cannot hit him when he has that ball out. At least I'm getting to the boss room more often now, so I'm, I feel like I'm getting marginally better, marginally. being told I can use the cape on the boss. So, if I spin attack him, it should help. I just always lose my cape before I get to that point. Uh, Cause like, I die on the initial like, flame. Come on, give me a big fat break! Corbin22 is here. Hello. Wow. I don't even think I can get up there if I try. Just trying to cheese it. Uh, I was about to say that makes things a little bit better. Cool. Let's play the game of will Richie ever beat this damn game? <laughs> oh. <laughs> uh. Just stumbling and fumbling at the finishing line here. jump away. <sighs> Richie's failure is sponsored by NordVPN, says some Norwegian guy. I wish, I wish it was sponsored by NordVPN. That'd be nice, wouldn't it? Oh, 
just right into the lava. Oh, man. I think my hands are getting tired, unfortunately. I've, we, this is, we've been going for two hours and 18 minutes here. Didn't get the timing right on that. Oh well, gotta move on. Wow. <laughs> well, they, they made it impossible to do that with the wizard coming at me right there. I still am super. It's just that beginning part of this whole thing that is the choke point. Let's try this again. Oh, look, the cape does not do anything to him. Good thing I beat him anyway. <laughs> you were wrong. The cape does not touch this boss. Maybe in the Game Boy Advance version, I don't know. Cape did nothing. <laughs> Oh well, beat it anyway! <laughs> Hooray! Thank you! Mario has defeated Larry Koopa in Castle 7! All that is left is Bowser's castle where Princess Toadstool is being held! Can Mario rescue her and restore peace to Dinosaur Land? Let's find out. It only took us like an hour to beat that level. We did it, guys. We are now finally at Bowser's Castle, the last level. We will attempt this a few times, but I do not know if we're going to beat this today. We might just have an entire Let's Play next time dedicated to Bowser's Castle. Let's find out if we're going to... If, if we can do anything about it. One. You gotta, like, you gotta beat all the areas. Yep. <laughs> At least we beat the other castle, right? <laughs> oh, this is where those extra blocks would come in handy, you see? Oh! Cool! Yeah, maybe I should try to get the red and blue blocks. I don't know. We're gonna, we're gonna keep trying this until until I know I can't go any further. Oh, oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. Xanderbro says, Xanderbro Super Chat, thank you for your Super Chat, Xanderbro. Xanderbro says, sounds like a good day for a car wash. Sup, Rich? <laughs> that is a reference to a very old Rich Alvarez video that I don't even care to explain. Yikes, I'm just gonna, just gonna let the flame kill me. Oh boy. Uh, 
Uh, Jessica Gold says, you don't have to beat all the sections unless you just want to. Well, which section do I have to beat? Let's see, can I just go... You no, know, I have to get to at least four. Let's see here. Cool. They all mimic the different castles that you've completed, you know. Uh, thank you, Daniel, for reminding me. I have seven lives left. Xanabrow, thank you for another super chat. Xanabrow says, work is dead, so here I am, lol. Let's try three. I think three is going to be the winner, though. Oh! Did I accidentally go into two? Oops. Two is the easiest then. Let's see, five, six, seven, eight. Eight's gonna be the easiest, even though there's those football players everywhere. I was pretty close to the end there. So yeah, we'll go two. Wow, that was easily avoidable. Oh boy. Daniel for reminding me I have four lives left. <laughs> Gotta sneeze. Two's easy. Come on, I had that. <laughs> uh, Jessica Gold says go to seven. Okay, so next time I'll do two and then I'll do seven. Seven might be easier or a little bit more manageable because those football players are a little unpredictable. Seven. Okay. Oh, dear. Are you sure seven's easier? Oh, and he moves. He moves. The little, little, little gold Bowser things. <laughs> There's not as much stuff jumping around there, so I, I trust you. Although, after I die this time, I have to get lives. My K 
Carrie says try six. Let's try six. Oh, it's underwater. Great. Why would you why would you do this to me? Oh, cool. Super. Oh, cool. Oh, fun. Oh, joy. Cool. I will not be doing that one again. No! That's okay. Uh, I have the continue from beating the castle a second ago, so... <laughs> It's okay, we're just gonna end up right here again anyway. Like, we'll find out. <laughs> yep, look at that, we're just gonna continue right here. We don't lose anything. Maybe that's why they have a castle as the level you beat right before Bowser's castle, so that way when you die, you just you just are right there at Bowser again. Who knows? We've been streaming for two and a half hours. Let's try number five. Oh, an in, in instantly regrettable decision. Actually, that's not that bad. <laughs> I think that's gonna be our one. Whoops. It's as simple as that, everybody. It's been a long time since I've played this boss. It's been a long time since I've tried to go through this entire game. I'm just gonna throw the little dudes. Got him once. Twice. Bowser likes his big balls. <laughs> Got him. Oops. Can't even touch the ball. It's almost running into that fire. Give me that 
Got one up. What up? Super mushroom. He's playing for keeps. Oops. <laughs> Got him once. Ugh. Oh, I was so close to... I think I got him. I think I got him. First try. First time into this boss room and I did. <laughs> this Bowser's castle was not nearly as hard as castle number seven. I'm just saying. <laughs> Mario's adventure is over. Mario, the princess, Yoshi, and his friends are going to take a vacation. And so am I. <laughs> oh my goodness. Well, everybody, we did it. Rich Alvarez finally finished a game on this channel. Can you believe it? <laughs> oh, wow. We did it. We beat a game. It only took me, what, uh, 17 YouTube years to do it. <laughs> oh, boy. We're going to watch the entire credit sequence. We did it. We did it. We did it. That's so exciting. I wish it didn't take me two and a half hours on the last one, though. So, oh, I noticed a lot of people. We started, we had like 35 people watching at one point. Now we're down to 22. They had no faith. <laughs> I only needed to I only needed to fight Bowser that one time. That's what I'm happiest about, is I didn't have to keep going again and again. <sighs> oh, Hayek, he says, I'm still here. <laughs> I gotta call Chris. Ah, uh, he didn't answer. I was really hoping, really, like, you're live. Uh, look at all the Yoshis are happy, Mario is happy, Peach is happy. Uh, the eggs are all happy. Where's Luigi? Who knows? I think I think if you do a two-player game, you'll also see Luigi. So, uh, should I start playing Final Fantasy VIII today? I mean, at the very least, le uh, at the very least, I'm gonna start playing it tomorrow. But now that I've beaten this game, I almost wonder if I should just start playing it today. Nah, yeah, I've, I've played enough video games today. This is gonna be my only stream today. I will start playing Final Fantasy VIII tomorrow, and I know they all voted for a lot of different things, but I'm most excited to play Final Fantasy VIII, and I think that's just what I'm gonna go with. We will continue to finish these credits, however. It's letting you know what everything's called. Van Fish. <laughs> yes, Killjoy, we got to the credits, and it only took me one attempt to beat Bowser. 
I don't know if you missed that. <laughs> Anthony says, but who's the guy in the red hat? <laughs> Ball and chain. Reznor in his only appearance. <laughs> oh, there's Chris. He's in the chat. Chris says, oh, wow. I come in at the end and Rich hits the credits. Well done, pal. Thank you, Chris. Once again, I only needed to go into the Bowser... Uh, I only needed to fight Bowser one time. First attempt. Not my first attempt at his castle, but it was my first attempt at, at fighting him, and I beat him on attempt number one. The end! That's the end of the game. And Chris, you should know, I let everyone be aware, this is the first, I believe this is the first time I've actually completed a game here on the Rich Alvarez channel. Uh, very exciting stuff. So we can title this one, like, number seven final in brackets or whatever. <laughs> and that's it. That's the end of the game. There is no more. There is no more. Yay! Killjoy super chatted and says, Yes, I missed it live, but congratulations on first completed Let's Play. Thank you a thousand times, Killjoy. You are the best. Thank you for the super chat. This is amazing. And like, I'm pressing start. I'm pressing things. Think, I think that's it. I think in back in the day, you just had to hit reset on the Super Nintendo or whatever. Uh, that is the end of the game. That is the end. There is no more. Uh, <laughs> but yeah, we completed a game. It's a most joyous occasion. Very, very exciting indeed. I will stay on for another couple of minutes just to see uh, what everybody says here. But we are basically wrapping up. Um, yeah, it's very, very cool. Very cool. Finally, a game is beaten on the Rich Alvers channel. And I intend to do the very same thing with Final Fantasy VIII. I'm going to beat Final Fantasy VIII to completion. Unless Chris tells me I should play something else, I really think it should be Final Fantasy VIII. <laughs> Okay, well I think that that's just about it then. Alright everybody, thank you so much for joining me on the stream. And remember, please subscribe! It's free and easy. Just like playing Super Mario World, which is free and easy, but not super easy. <laughs> Hooray! Alright, uh, no, Chris says, I like the idea of FF8. I remember having fun watching you play that back in the day. It will be very nostalgic, so that's it. We are going to play Final Fantasy VIII, but I think I will start it tomorrow because I've been streaming for almost three hours today because I really wanted to finish this game. It is the first time we've ever completed a whole game here on the Rich Alves channel. Super exciting. I think if you add all of the Let's Plays up, we've probably it probably took us about 10 hours to beat this game. But yeah, still very, very exciting. Uh, yeah. All right, everybody. I hope you have a great day and I will see you tomorrow. Bye-bye. <laughs>